All right, hey guys. Um, so I just wanted to make a YouTube video real quick because I have a 2016 Ford Explorer and my um, armrest, um, as you can see, it, uh, it got a tear and I put some duct tape to protect it so it didn't get worse. Um, but I bought an actual replacement on Amazon that goes over this. Um, you take this, remove it, and then put on the new one. So trying to get this thing off, I was trying to find information on how to remove this, and there just really isn't a lot of good uh, information or videos. So I, um, I wanna make this so I can show you guys how easy it is, okay? So the first thing you wanna do, um, again, this is a 2016 model. I'm pretty sure it's the same for 2017, 18. Um, you wanna get a uh, just a regular old flathead screwdriver, and you wanna go like, around the top right here and then right here you just want to apply some pressure it'll it'll unsnap and then along the sides you want to go about right here and then down here same thing okay right here and right here so once you just put a little pressure it'll unsnap it'll come right out so as you can see there's some tabs those tabs just go right in there in the holes so don't worry, uh, it comes out pretty easy. I didn't break anything. Um, the plastic actually feels really strong, so I don't think anybody's gonna break any of their tabs, okay? So you should be, you should be good. Um, so then once you get to this point, you can already see that this was put on with a crap load of staples. I mean, there's gotta be over 50 staples in here, which that's good news because that's how I'm gonna put my new one back on. I'm gonna also use a stapler. Um, and then the best part is when, when you get to this part down here, you just have to unscrew it with one, two, three, four, four star screws. All right. So as long as you guys have like a little star screw kit, um, something similar to this, this has all the different sizes. I'm pretty positive. I'm going to have the right size to go ahead and take this off. And that's pretty much it. I mean, once I figured it out, I'm like, Jesus, this is super easy. I just can't believe that nobody made a good video for us. Um, so go ahead and have fun. Um, you can get your new um, uh, synthetic leather material on Amazon. And it wasn't even like more than $20, I don't believe. All right, thanks. All right, so the other thing you're gonna have to do is uh, pull off all the staples. From the old, uh, from the old skin. So as you can see, here's a, here's some right here. There was probably at least 50 staples all through here. So as you can see, I've just been kind of throwing them aside right here. Um, it's not too hard, you know. I just, uh, just used a, a thin, a thin chisel. You can use a flathead screwdriver or a thin chisel, and a good old-fashioned plier to, uh, to pull out the stubborn ones. I've only been working on this for about 10 minutes and I almost have it completely done. I just have about eight more staples. Look, you can see all the old staple marks. And then get this done right here, and I'll be done, and I'll be ready to put on the new skin and staple it all over again with a little Stanley stapler. And then uh, probably take me about two minutes to screw it back in, and we're done. All right, and real quick, I forgot to mention which brand I bought. I bought the KBH brand on Amazon. It's uh, one of the first ones you'll see when you look up the um, armrest cloth. And then um, I tried to re uh, staple mine just like it was, but my stapler wasn't penetrating the hard plastic. So instead, I basically did what it says here. I just used adhesive. Um, I use like an epoxy, a two part epoxy adhesive. And um, I just wait for like maybe 10 minutes for the epoxy to get sticky. And then when it was sticky enough, I just went ahead and um, used my fingers to adhere the material and it stuck great. Um, so I really didn't need to use staples. I just used adhesive, two part epoxy and then again, here is the brand on Amazon. Um, everything was pretty smooth. So I hope this video helps out everybody who wants to fix their armrest. Thanks.